This video includes a paid sponsorship from Omaze. Help Omaze support the work of the Juju Foundation and enter for a chance to win a Tesla Model S Plaid that has been customized by Unplugged Performance. Find out more at omaze.com forward slash cleanerwatt. I've also put a link in the video description. As you may have seen, Tesla recently brought back Enhanced Autopilot as a $6,000 software upgrade, which adds some really great features to their existing Autopilot software, the basic free software that comes with every Tesla that you purchase today. But just how does Enhanced Autopilot, this $6,000 upgrade, compare to Tesla's basic free Autopilot that's included with Tesla's vehicles that you purchase right now? And also, how does it compare to the $12,000 full self-driving upgrade package. I'm John and welcome to Cleaner Watt. I recently had the opportunity to test drive a performance Tesla Model Y for a couple days. And even though that car has a lot of great features and technology, the one technology, the one feature that I liked the best was the autopilot software. Those who've experienced autopilot firsthand know just how impressive Tesla's autopilot software is, even the free basic autopilot software that I recently tested. Tesla's basic autopilot software is impressive. However, if you want some of the more advanced features which we're going to talk about in this video, um, as a buyer or as a current Tesla owner, you do have two great upgrade choices. The first one is the enhanced autopilot for $6,000 extra. And the second is what Tesla calls full self-driving for a $12,000 upgrade. In addition to that, for those who really don't wanna drop at the time of purchase or just spend immediately $12,000 on a full self-driving upgrade to their autopilot software, Tesla now offers subscriptions. So for instance, if you have not upgraded at all and you just have the basic free Tesla autopilot, uh, for $199 per month, you can actually sign up for a subscription to their full self-driving upgrade. And if you already upgraded to Enhanced Autopilot and paid for that software, you can upgrade to the full self-driving package for $99 a month. Now, before I talk about the differences between Tesla's basic autopilot and the features you get when you upgrade to Tesla's Enhanced Autopilot, or if you move all the way up to Tesla's full self-driving upgrade, before we dive into those features, I'm excited to be working with the sponsor of today's video, Omaze, to offer you a chance to win an unplugged performance Tesla Model S Apex Plaid and support a great cause, the Juju Foundation. Go to omaze.com forward slash cleanerwatt to enter for a chance to win this amazing car. The Tesla Model S Plaid is the latest top of the line Tesla with cutting edge technology and a stunning zero to 60 mile per hour time of just 1.99 seconds. On top of all that, the artisans at Unplugged Performance have made a number of incredible customizations to this already amazing car, which now features a gorgeous cognac colored vegan bamboo leather interior, a satin white vinyl wrapped exterior, the S Apex conversion, which includes the 19 piece carbon fiber wide body kit, upgraded 21 inch wheels, dynamic air suspension lowering kit, and also importantly, carbon ceramic brakes. And on top of that, taxes and shipping are included for US winners. Remember that donations help support the amazing work of the Juju Foundation, which is a nonprofit organization dedicated to the support of youth initiatives and lifting the spirits of those in need. So what are you waiting for? To find out more and to enter for a chance to win an unplugged performance Tesla Model S Apex Plaid, go to omaze.com forward slash cleaner watt and enter now. I'll also put a link to that in the video description. Now, going back to our topic about Tesla's autopilot software and the upgrade choices you have, it's really good to just once again be clear that if you have basic autopilot, enhanced autopilot, or even the full self-driving upgrade, uh, it's still technically a level two system. Tesla's vehicles are not fully autonomous vehicles, and they still require the driver to pay attention, keep their eyes on the road, and keep their hands on the steering wheel. Ultimately, the driver is still in control of the vehicle and must be ready to take over at any time. With that being said, let's talk about the features that Tesla includes in their basic autopilot software. Tesla's basic autopilot software really combines two useful features 
into one. Traffic aware cruise control, which is sometimes called adaptive cruise control, and what Tesla calls auto steer, which is basically a uh, single lane support. When driving a Tesla vehicle on a road with very clear lane markings, this allows the driver to initiate and turn on autopilot. Obviously the driver pays attention, keeps their eyes on the road, hands on the steering wheel, but it allows the Tesla vehicle to stay in a single lane, um, follow that lane as it kind of curves about and also control the speed um, and adjust to vehicles in front of them. It's actually really great software. And uh, when I recently tested it, I found it to be very effective. Um, it was very enjoyable to use as well. However, it is important once again to just point out that it only offers single lane support. Meaning if you want to change lanes, if you're driving your vehicle down the highway and you want to change lanes, you have to disengage autopilot, manually change lanes, and then re-engage autopilot. It's not awful and it's not a terrible experience, but um, if you upgrade, that feature gets improved upon. So let's now move into some of the features that are available with Enhanced Autopilot. If you pay for the $6,000 Enhanced Autopilot upgrade, you get what Tesla calls Navigate on Autopilot. According to Tesla's definition, quote, Navigate on Autopilot actively guides your car from highway on-ramp to off-ramp, including suggesting lane changes, navigating interchanges, automatically engaging the turn signal, and taking the correct exit. This is obviously a really great feature and is quite effective uh, for highway driving. Also included in this upgrade is a feature called auto lane change, which if you have autopilot software enabled and you engage your turn signal, this allows your car to change lanes if it's safe to do so without having to disengage autopilot. In addition, you get Tesla's auto park functionality, their basic summon functionality, and also their smart summon functionality, which really takes summon to a whole new level. So is enhanced autopilot worth an extra $6,000 right now? Well, if you drive a lot on the highway and uh, you want more than just single lane support, if you like summon, uh, smart summon and auto park features, I think it, it's great. I mean, when you look up videos of people using the software, it works very well. It's a very effective software suite. So I think it's a great choice for those who don't want to pay the full $12,000 and move to their full self-driving package, which we'll talk about in a minute, which still may be worth the money to you. But for those who don't want to move fully to that, the enhanced autopilot package seems like a great deal at $6,000. Yes, that's still a lot of money, but it adds some great features. Okay, so we've talked about basic autopilot, we've talked about enhanced autopilot. Let's talk about Tesla's full self-driving upgrade package. What does that include? If you purchase Tesla's full self-driving software upgrade, you get traffic and stop sign control, which is still currently in beta, but according to Tesla, it will quote, identify stop signs and traffic lights and automatically slows your car to stop on approach with of course, active supervision. And you gotta be ready to take over. Nonetheless, this is a really cool, fun feature. Now that first feature is something that all purchasers of the full self-driving upgrade can enjoy. This next feature is something that's still only in a limited group of people in their hands, the full self-driving beta group. And that's what Tesla calls auto steer on city streets. This is essentially somewhat like the autopilot software that works on the highway with the navigate on autopilot, but it's that for city streets. It's still once again in beta, it still makes mistakes and requires complete driver supervision. However, it is coming a long way and it's getting very impressive. Here are a few clips from the YouTube channel AI Driver, and you can see just how effective this software really is. I definitely recommend checking out the AI Driver YouTube channel so you can subscribe and watch this full video, which I have linked below in the video description. Now, once again, the full self-driving package that Tesla offers does not make your car fully autonomous, right now, and Tesla does offer the following disclaimer on their website, quote, the currently enabled autopilot, enhanced autopilot, and full self-driving features require active driver supervision and do not make the vehicle autonomous. Full autonomy will be dependent on achieving reliability far in excess of human drivers as demonstrated by billions of miles of experience, as well as regulatory approval, which may take longer in some jurisdictions as Tesla Autopilot, Enhanced Autopilot, and full self-driving capabilities evolve 
your car will be continuously upgraded through over-the-air software updates. So to summarize this and really kind of put this all on one page, you can see here on this chart uh, what is included in each of these software upgrades. The basic autopilot includes those first two categories, enhanced autopilot ads, navigate on autopilot, auto lane change, auto park, summon, and smart summon. However, if you want that traffic and stop sign control, which is currently in beta, you have to move the full self-driving upgrade. And if you want that future auto steer on city streets and eventually what Tesla believes they can get to full self-driving, then the full self-driving package is the package that should allow you to do that in the future. At the end of the day, I think enhanced autopilot is quite a good deal. Um, and it allows you to go ahead and pay for features that you can use all of those features right now that are very effective and that have been out for some time. So they do pretty good. Like they're actually really good features. If you want to take a bet on Tesla's future, you can pay that $12,000 and get the full self-driving functionality when that becomes available in the future. Um, and that may be a great choice for you as well. But at the end of the day, it's your choice. I do want to say once again, thank you to Omaze who sponsored this video. Help Omaze support the work of the Juju Foundation and enter for a chance to win a Model S Plaid that has been customized by Unplugged Performance. Find out more at omaze.com forward slash cleanerwatt. And once again, there's a link in the video description. Thank you so much for watching this video all the way through to the end. I'd like to take a moment to thank the Patreon supporters who support me every month and help make this content possible. A special thank you to my performance supporters and also the other supporters listed on the screen. If you'd like to find out more about the Patreon community I've set up and how you can support my work, I'll put a link in the video description. Thank you so much.